Good morning, good morning. From Chicago, the risk management capital of the world. I'm Alan Nuckman here at the CME Group with Morning Market Stir for Monday, October the 12th. Bounce in blue chips. Blue chips led the way last week, up three and three quarters. Let's start with the S&P. The S&P gained three and one half percent, closing up one point on Friday, three and a half percent on a weekly basis, at 2007 and one half, back above the 2000 level. The high on Friday was 2014. Back to the Dow, the Dow added 25, 16,991, leading the way on a weekly basis up three and three quarters percent, more than 1,600 Dow points off that extreme low from August. The Nasdaq's pushing higher as well, not pushing above the 4,400 just yet. We'll want to keep an eye on that. 4,359 and a half up 15 was the laggard on a weekly basis up two and a quarter percent. The dollar drifted lower down 52 at 94.88 below that 95 level, which is solidly below 96, obviously. The euro currency 113.77 up 93. Treasuries were somewhat tame up 16 to 156.29. Psychologically, we saw crude make a move above $50 a barrel, 50.92, uh, multi month highs there, closed at 49.63, which was up a whopping 20 cents, but it did push through $50 intraday. Also on the upside with the weaker dollar was gold, gold 11.56, up $12 on the session. So after a positive week last week and ex the Dow extending its gain to a record for 2015, six sessions, where do the market stand here on this Monday morning? Well, we're steady to positive right now, up half a point in the median S&P 2008, uh, up 15, 15 points in the Dow future 17,006, and up two in the NASDAQ at 4,362. Currencies are quiet today, 94.80 down eight, uh, in the dollar index, euro currency up six at 113.85, and that's because the treasury market, the cash treasury market, is closed for the Columbus Day holiday. 157.02 right now is where we stand in the futures, which is up six. Again, cash is closed, unchanged there, so that should keep rates, uh, both currency rates and interest rates, somewhat subdued today. Crude oil up another 15 cents, 49.75, the high of the session so far, uh, 50.13. So pressing on uh, yesterday's, Friday's highs anyways, and staying, uh, staying right near that $50 barrel level. And lastly was gold, up $11 right now at 11.67, continuing to move higher as the dollar is not getting any more strength. So to wrap up this current action with two hours to go before the cash stock market open, we're up a half in the S&P, half a point, up 15 in the Dow futures, and up two points in the NASDAQ 100. I will see you early Tuesday morning for your morning market stir to set up your trading day. Alan Nuckman here at the CME Group where it all comes back to commodities.